Kansas, where little old Sue loves to know how my daughter's doing. Or I could be trying to get into the head of a powerful Russian who knows the world wants his phone number. That's when the psychology kicks in, and I go to work. If they pick up the phone, they're mine. That's the game. I started when I was uh, 29, 30. <laughs> my boss. My boss was a... Sometimes I wonder what happened to her. But we all had the same feeling. This can't last. And sure enough, we were right. First the crops. And pretty soon, we wouldn't be able to breathe the air. I remember looking at Emmy and wondering what kind of a future would she have. So I decided to do something about it. The Mars project was plan B for planet Earth, which was most evidently The oh, family and I had already put down roots in Tesla City by the time the great catastrophe really hit. The corporation knew my contacts in the world of drilling and refining would be useful. So I adapted my skills to something more practical. Now we are all that keeps this little planet running. Mining those Martian camps. My pure little Emma has a future. When somebody sits down and writes this all up for the history books, it might just be men like me they'll be hailing as heroes. It's men like me who saved humanity. Men like me who took us further than we ever dreamt possible. Radio nostalgia from Mars. Oh, some pretty heavy stuff. Reminds us that all kinds made it up here to Mars, but we're all in it together now. And remain creatures of the world. You're a tight beam to Radio Nostalgia from Mars. Music for the lost days of Earth. Requests, please follow habitat protocols for sanitation. No liquids other than bodily in the main bin, including pee. Some of you don't like it, but all water is recycled, so pee into the funnel installed next to your toilet, please. Speaking of pee and poop, we recently welcomed our first official little Martian to the colony, and our next caller, Sophia, tells us what it's like to be a new mother on Mars. I'm so happy we moved to Mars. It was a project I funded from the very beginning. I knew it has potential and I trusted the amazing team working on it. As angel investors, my husband and I got early placements in the Ark ship. I'm so grateful for the opportunity to further human survival in our solar system. Speaking of the human project, I have some exciting news. Just a week ago, we welcomed our baby boy into the world. Words cannot express how overjoyed we are at welcoming little Maxim. Putting him to bed reminds me of my parents. From our window here in Tesla City, we can see the earth, tiny enough to fit in Maxim's hand. It pains me that my child might never experience the beauty of my home in the Hamptons the nature, coastline, the old lighthouse, and the food, the houses of our friends, our evening parties, full of life compared to this barren, rugged terrain. I send my little Martian to sleep with a lullaby my mother sang for me. Thanks to these songs, I'm able to retain, at least on a rudimentary level, my mother tongue. <laughs> 
Your life is the water that sustains it. You may have noticed that it doesn't rain here on Mars. So another friendly reminder that showers are strictly limited to 30 seconds each with no exceptions. Corporate is looking into extending this time frame, but is meeting resistance from Section BC who want lab rat urine to be excluded from the water recycling program, which would actually reduce allocated shower times to 27 seconds. Want to say in this? Join our sectional weekly meetings and vote while sipping on a relaxing tube of OMAS. Feels good? As it should. Radio Nostalgia from Mars. Listening to Radio Nostalgia from Mars. Well, what can I say? No wonder that song got into her head. But with a little help from some friends, she pulled through. Another thing that can get into your head is living conditions here on Mars. Life up here on Mars can get a bit overwhelming at times, so along with a soothing OMAS drink, no stress, no fuss. It bears mentioning that wellness counselling is mandatory for all team members, regardless of rank or tenure. The wellness sessions are completely confidential and anonymous, but do remember that all conversations are monitored and recorded for security reasons, and you must have your ID badge and sectional access pass visible. Dolorosa ci fu la partenza e il ritorno per molti non fu Radio Nostalgia from Mars (laughs) 